What up everybody, so making a, a Pokemon Go video for a change. Because Pokemon Go Fest was today. I didn't get to go. I had to work and everything, but I know a lot of people that did go. And they got some a uh, bunch of legendaries. I haven't been playing too much since I hit 38. I still don't have a gold uh, gym badge. Because like I said, I haven't been playing too much. So I got quite a bit of badges, been to plenty of gyms. But I did get this gold. Still working on this one. Other badges are getting closer to gold. Especially the rats. I haven't done many raids. But let's get a... Uh, I believe this will be my seven day streak. And there's extra candy and stardust and everything going on right now. And XP. All thanks to GoFest. So I got 6,200 Stardust and 12 Candies. Fortunately, it's not a tiny rat. Alright, so... Got a little bit of stuff to do, because I've been saving up a bunch of random crap. Hope, hoping, in hopes of double ca transfer candies. Such as now, we finally get it. While I'm scro scrolling through this, you guys can have a look at all the Pokemon I have. So we got 12 Machop candy, which we can use on this guy. So he's still pretty darn weak, but it's a project and a half, but once he's finally maxed out and I get the movesets changed, he'll be really good for raids and everything. Oh yeah, can't forget about all these.
Those are helpful candies. Because I'm going to evolve this guy. This little chancy here someday. 96% of these make myself another big fat blissy. But not put it over 3000 CP. Is in here. Don't really need the candy, but I saved a bunch anyways. Twenty-five Lapras's. See ya. Fifty candies. This guy's completely maxed out. 146 candies now. I transfer a lot of these that I didn't name candy. So I'm just going to transfer away the ones I did name candy first. But I'll go through all the rest of them. So I got 168 Snorlax candies now. These Trichinis. Dragonairs. We're gonna keep that 20 just because it's so low CP for that. Transfer those two though. Decent amount of Dragonites named as Candy too. Now the ten Dragonites going. So I now have a total of 563 Dratini candy. Now we're into Gen 2. Got a whole bunch of Togepi's for some reason. A little bit of Mareep candies. Got 84 total of those. Let's 
think I've hatched all these Sudowoodoos. I'm gonna just delete two of them. Still love this guy, even though it didn't get that big. But I still think it's pretty cool. Yeah, that's right. I got a giraffe rig in the gym. Got a lot of man times. More than likely, we're gonna delete more than half of those. We got a few blissies named Candy. We got even more. Alright, now finally we're into where we want the candy the most. The Larvitars. That's some good candy. And even more from pukes. There we go. Now I still got all these little level guys that I use for the bubble strategy before the new gym rework happened. I used to be able to put a 24 CP defender into the gym, then just kill it over and over and over with a 12 CP ghastly. Neither one of them, uh, the attacker would not die, and you'd get a thousand gym XP in a matter of seconds. And it worked perfectly. Just had to have all the other guys also in the gym when you're going to attack. But now we can finally make this guy our highest CP Pokemon ever. Until I start getting some legendaries, hopefully. I think this is the last power up I got. 3604. Bam, there he is at the top. I'm waiting to get that guy up here. I've been walking a uh, Pupitar forever, trying to get the candies, waiting for the double transfer candies. I've literally walked this guy 615 kilometers. I also love the fact that uh, you only gotta walk 1.7 km's right now for each candy instead of five. I don't know how long all these XP bonuses and everything lasts, but I'll definitely enjoy them while they're here. And if you guys are wondering how much total XP I got, I got a little over 12.3 million, and it's 20 million XP total to get to 40. 
as you can see, I need 3 million XP to get to 39. Then from 39 to 40 is 5 million. So I'm gonna collect all this fodder here and just transfer it away. And I also got. Oh wow! I'm only gonna walk 3.3 kilometers to hatch all these 10Ks. That is awesome. So those will be hatched real fast while I'm at work. Then while I'm on my lunch break, I'm probably going to have to go and try and get some more eggs. So this is crazy. Well anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this Pokemon Go video. Let me know if you guys like them. Maybe I'll make some more in the future if I continue to play. And maybe I'll make a legendary raid or something. But I hope you guys enjoy them. And have a good one.